Next pump, 12.09, they said. Twelve oh nine, they said for the next bump. Just heads up. I need a bump. Thirty. Thirty. Clear. Two away from hit. Yeah. So I imagine she should probably stand off to the side. 
So we're about to do the live hit, so just I'll be standing a little bit here a bit more, but not yet. Soon. Ninety seconds. Can the rim? There's Can the Ram marching down. CSU fans cheering. Again, by the way, for folks joining us on live stream, I'm about to be on Nine News at noon, so we're alternating a little bit, but hello. Got a whole gang of characters. Oh my gosh, is that a mini pony? Oh! That is adorable. I was talking about the Powerball. No, I'm talking about the mini pony. Thirty out. Oh. <laughs> Fifteen. Yeah, by the way, we just had a marching band go by, so that's why I got my uh, finger in my ear here. But the uh, parade just getting going for the first time, and it's the first time, by the way, in three years. Last year, uh, the parade was canceled due to uh, temperatures and some snow. The year before is because of COVID. So it's the first time since 2020 that we've got the annual stock show parade that's underway right now. We got some horses marching on by. We just had Cam the Ram go by, and we had this really adorable mini pony. Uh, I will admit that I am not the, I don't know exact things with animals, but it was some sort of a mini pony. I will tell you that and it was really, really adorable. But that said, first time in three years that we've had the annual sock show parade going on here. And uh, this is also gonna be going on until about two o'clock. This is 17th Street here in downtown Denver. So all the horses, the cows, the longhorn cattle, they're marching down at about Glen Arm. So that's gonna be the parade route. We are of course right in front of Union Station right now. So these uh, animals will be marching on down to about uh, Glen Arm here on 17th Street. As I mentioned, first time in three years that we've had this. This is an annual tradition that goes by, the parade itself goes back to the 1960s. The actual Nas National Western Sh Stock Show uh, goes back to the early 1900s. So it's an 117 year tradition that we're talking about. And this is the annual kind of kickoff event to mark that. So the parade itself goes back to the 1960s. The stock show itself goes back to the early 1900s. So stunningly long tradition, about as Colorado as it gets. And I guess the last thing I'll leave you with, oh, I was hoping we were gonna have some horses, some cattle coming on down, but not quite in time, but come on down. It's been a blast here, Erica, and I'll be here till about two o'clock. Yes. All right, awesome. Thanks, Erica. Thanks. Sorry.
For those of you joining us on 9 Plus, I'm Chris Bianchi here in downtown Denver, and uh, I'm gonna stay out of the shot so you can see all the beautiful horses, all the ponies that are strolling their way out through downtown Denver as we speak. We are right in front of Union Station for the annual stock show parade, and this has been a blast, honestly, here so far, folks. This is my first time being here, and it's the first, by the way, parade in three years. Uh, this is the annual kind of kickoff event for the National Western Stock Show itself. And this is, again, the first time in three years it's happened. Last year is because of snow and cold. The year before that, it was due to COVID that we didn't have the annual uh, parade. Now, the parade goes, goes back to the kind of mid-1960s in terms of how long they've been doing this parade. The stock show itself, though, does go all the way back to the early 1900s. It's considered to be the kind of kickoff event for it. So we're talking about this each year. This is, again, the kind of annual kickoff event for that, uh, by the way. For those of you who have been streaming this for the last little while, you've probably heard me talking with my producers a little bit as I just had a hit on air on 9 News at noon just a few minutes ago. So right now you're just going to get me unfiltered, uh, trying to name a bunch of animals that I don't know. I didn't really grow up with animals, so I don't, <laughs> I don't know uh, a ton of what I'm talking about. So just in full transparency on that front. That said, that is not stopping me or anybody from out here from having all sorts of fun. There are tons and tons of folks out here, a lot of first timers too, and it's also a little chilly, but you know what? It's not all that bad. I've been out here for a good hour or so, and it's not that bad. Uh, I feel pretty comfortable right now. Temperatures in the mid-30s. I think for the animals, they probably love this. It's got to be pretty comfortable temperatures if you got a bunch of fur on you, but uh, that's, that's neither here nor there. Uh, but again, we're just seeing some horses come on down. We had earlier Cam the Ram. We had this adorable miniature pony uh, that came on through, and my colleague at Nine News, Erica Lopez, did assure me that was the correct term, that it is a miniature pony. I had no idea what I was talking about, but I, she, I just threw that out there, but she told me that was right. But in the meantime, looks like we're stopped here for a quick second. We've had a few high school marching bands come up through, so we've had high school marching bands, we've had horses, we've had cattle, we've had also uh, had sheep. And we've also had, I mentioned, Cam the Ram. So, by the way, this is 17th Street, what you're looking at here, as I mentioned, in front of the Union Station. They're going to march down about Glenarm. The parade will continue for the next hour or so as well. Yeah, everybody waving out there. I'm going to, by the way, kneel on down so some of the folks that are right here watching can see as well. Isn't this cool, though? I don't know. I, went, I grew up in the New York area. And I went to school in Boston, and the thought of seeing a bunch of horses and cattle going down to Main Street is got to be unique to Denver. That This is awesome. This is really cool to watch and see as all the cattle, all the horse, horses marching on down here right in front of Union Station, about as Colorado as it gets right now, isn't it? This is awesome. Mountain Dew truck. <laughs> and coming on by. I'm sure we'll get some more animals here in the next little while. Looks like maybe we're transitioning to dogs as I see some, some extreme dog signs coming. Oh, there we go. Yes. Oh, yes. I'm a dog lover. So this is, this is awesome. We got the, our four-legged friends, our best friends coming on through. They look like they're having a grand old time marching around and Look at that, we got some Collies, we got some Goldens, we got some Labs, we got some Poodles for sure, some Bulldogs. Oh, this is adorable. Oh, this is awesome. Oh. Again, I'm a big dog lover, so that, 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 that went straight to my heart. That went straight to my heart, seeing those dogs come on by. This is Colorado's gets here, folks. And now we're going to have uh, more horses coming on down.
Okay, this goes on until about 2 o'clock, so we're going to have the parade go on until about 2. Got a bunch of folks out here. Feel free to, yeah, feel free to chime on in. There we go. There we go. I think for, by the way, cheer, if it, is this your first time? If it's your first time at the parade, cheer. Awesome. So, yes, we got a bunch of first timers here. Again, both my photographer, Corky Scholl, and I are first times as well, so. I should cheer. Yeah, yeah, welcome. It's not your first time, is it? It is. Oh, awesome. So, it is yours? Awesome. First time. And for, for everybody, it's, nobody's been here in three years, so for a lot of us, first time. So, Murdoch stand. I don't think that's a real animal there. I think that's a mascot, but I we'll, we'll, we'll confirm that later on. We got some horses coming on down. Had a lot of horses. It's been the the main player. I believe that is a. I don't believe that's an actual animal that you're looking at here. I believe that's a stretch limousine with some horns, <laughs> but we'll, we'll, we'll confirm that with we'll some, confirm that. we'll confirm Thank that you. again. Uh, <laughs> it's Colorado's outstanding team coming on by, so getting some periodic humans coming on through as well. Here come the horses. And this is just awesome. Again, look at where we are, right in front of Union Station, downtown Denver. We got all these horses, all these animals coming on down here. Sorry, guys. How many horses have we seen? Five. I th yeah, I think it's hundreds, hundreds. Gotta say a couple hundred horses at this point. I really, I didn't think I would like the dogs as much as I did, but that was, that's been my favorite part so far. Oh. We got it, that's up close and personal, right there. Oh, there's, there's one of the uh, mini horses coming on by as well. And you can hear the uh, ooing and aahing as everybody gets excited about the mini horses. Got some more horses. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Hello. We got a little yell lab here coming on through as well. More horses. Again, I apologize. I can't tell you too much of a difference between the horses. I'm just going to be transparent about that. Oh, we got a full semicircle here from some of the horses. That's getting the crowd all excited as well. Is that a, is that a pizza truck? <laughs> That is a pizza truck. This is randomly a pizza truck here as well. We got more horses coming on down. Again, I would say we've had at least 300 horses come on down. Maybe, maybe more than that. We don't have a float this year. 
No, no, we, we had, uh, uh, we don't have a float in this, but we had one in the uh, Parade of Lights just a few, uh, a month ago, a couple weeks ago. And there's more of these horses. I think behind, Hey, Skylar. How's it going, man? Boys, <laughs> fuck Skylar McKinley from AAA, and also a rancher as well. And he's on one of those bands, sorry, I knew the guy, so. Not the most common running. Oh, we got, okay. We got some, some turkey up there. That one survived. We got a turkey up here. That's a big turkey. There's some goats back here. time. More horses. These ones from Jeffco. Streaming. We are live streaming until two o'clock, I think. I think anyway, oh, I think we got a Vishla here. And a bunch more horses. Again, we're, 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 we gotta be closing out 500 horses. Basically. We got a band coming and a donkey. So, my donkey friends, you'll be excited about this. And, uh, so we got an older horse here making the trek down 17th Street downtown Denver. Wait, 
would say it's kind of like a college football field. I mean, man, it's a lot of fun music, fun vibe. Uh, it's like, it feels like a tailgate for a college football game. Oh, Thank uh -huh.